Hi, I'm Greg Gifford, SEM Rush Academy professor, and today I'm going to show you how to quickly get rid of thousands of unwanted backlinks to avoid Google penalties. Your backlink profile is like a huge forest made up of many different kinds of trees. Without a guide, you can easily get lost wandering in the forest forever. Today I'm going to share a story about how to use a set of filters from the backlink audit tool to easily navigate and clean up a bunch of backlinks. If you're lost in the link forest, our outdoor survival guide comes in the form of information and gathering as much of it as you can. Set up a backlink audit project in SEM Rush, connect Google Search Console to sync with real-time backlinks, and integrate with Google Analytics to learn about more traffic. Next, we add our list of inedible plants. Upload a disavow file to exclude already submitted domains from the analysis. You should start with the follow backlinks with a toxic score in the range of 60 to 100. These are the links that are most likely to cause a Google penalty. Furthermore, this filter may be applied with additional filters to highlight patterns or other markers to pick up toxic backlinks. Here's where things get exciting. When you combine filters, you're able to see patterns and then batch send backlinks to the remove or disavow lists. Let's apply a few filters. Now, analyze the data by blocks, by IP grouping, by GA, by mirror pages, by occurrence of certain phrases in the title, the URL, in anchor text, and by markers. Try filtering by IP. Toxic links with different domains can sometimes come from the same IP address. Most likely, the suspicious heading will be part of a bigger group, which can be sent to the remove list in one click. The same can be done by filtering the links marked as mirror. After applying each filter, decide whether to remove or disavow the backlinks in the list. If the links are untrustworthy, send them to remove. This is a templated remove request sent to the site owners. If the backlinks are outright spam or contacting the sites doesn't seem to be possible, you'll want to disavow. Focus on patterns. Copy a repeating fragment of a URL and use it as a filter, then select and delete groups of backlinks with the same suspicious pattern. Keep yourself safe. Get a better picture of the link profile by using additional data such as the authority score, country IP, referral traffic from GA, backlink novelty, and other markers. Now you know how to navigate your forest of backlinks by combining different filters in different sequences to quickly get rid of large arrays of links. This is an extensive topic and more detailed info can be found in a large SEMrush study on Google penalties. Check the link in the description. I hope you like this video and that it helps you to better understand the backlink audit tool and its various elements. Feel free to leave a comment and share your personal experience with the tool. Subscribe to the SEMrush YouTube channel so you don't miss upcoming episodes with more marketing insights. That's all for today. Once again, I'm Greg Gifford. Stay tuned.